One of the coolest things discovered last week is that animals probably evolved bioluminescence, which is the ability to glow, 540 million years ago, which is almost 300 million years earlier than previous estimates. How did they figure this out? Well, in 2022, this paper came out containing a super, super thorough, well-supported evolutionary family tree of a group of corals called the octocorals, which I had not heard of until reading this paper, so I guess I'm a fake fan. Anyway, a lot of octocorals bioluminesce in a mechanically simple way, like they glow kind of randomly when stuff bumps into them. So these new researchers, which included two of the people who worked on this paper, figured that this was probably a really, really ancient form of bioluminescence. Before they could do any estimating about how old this adaptation was, they had to put this evolutionary family tree on a timeline, and they did that by taking information from some fossil octocorals where the age of the fossils was known, and plugging that information into the evolution family tree and using that to estimate how long ago the different branches of this tree split from each other. Then they went out and caught a bunch of modern octocorals to figure out which ones could bioluminesce, and they only tested corals which seemed healthy because they figured they might get false negatives if they tested an individual one that was too sick to glow even if it came from a species that could glow. That information is neither here nor there, but it kind of like tickles me that they mentioned it. Then they did a whole bunch of computational statistics witchcraft on it. Listen, don't look me like that, I have made it into the Dunning-Kruger Valley on this stuff and I know how much I don't know. Anyway, the oracle told them 540 million years ago is when this group of animals probably first evolved this trait, which is actually slightly before the beginning of the Cambrian period. So for whom were they bioluminescing? Did stuff have eyes then? So the short answer is yes, some things probably had eyes at the dawn of the Cambrian period, but that doesn't have to be the reason why octocorals evolved bioluminescence, because also this type of bioluminescent reaction uses oxygen as a reactant, which means it consumes environmental oxygen in the process, which protects any organism that does this from oxidative damage. Yes, oxygen can poison you sometimes. This might have been the original function of octocoral bioluminescence, and it was only after eyes became more common in the Cambrian oceans, that this ability took on a second function as communication with things that could see, which is so cool. This and all my other content was brought to you thanks partly to my Patreon supporters, in particular besties Anton, Coleman, David, Juan, Martin, and Michael, as well as the friends named on the screen here. Thank you.